I'd like to thank Christopher Hilburn for allowing us to come to his poultry farm today and videotape some of his biosecurity techniques. One of the first lines of defense to avoid disease on a farm is gates and signage. This helps stop unauthorized visitors and trucks from entering the farm without thinking about biosecurity first. One way to reduce the introduction of diseases to a poultry farm is to have dedicated clothing and footwear to be used only on the farm. In this case, the producer has a locker where he's got footwear and clothing to be used on the farm. In addition, they have disposable shoe covers to be used with visitors. An important part of a good biosecurity program is they have a properly maintained foot bath. One part of maintaining a, a good foot bath is to keep it out of the elements. In this particular case, the producer has the foot bath in his control room. However, it is important that if this is not acceptable for you or is not workable on your particular farm, that you have it under some sort of awning so that rainwater does not fall into it and, and dilute it out. Before entering the farm, the poultry house, it's important to step into the foot bath. In this case, with the granulated product, make sure it covers the bottom of your shoes as well as the sides before entering the house. Before leaving the house, it's important to knock off any organic material, primarily chicken litter, off your shoes before leaving the house and entering again into the foot bath. Organic material, either in the, the, the powdered, the granulated product foot bath, or in the, the water foot bath, will render them less effective or completely ineffective in reducing pathogens from either entering or leaving your poultry house. When leaving a poultry farm, it's important to leave your trash behind. In this case, my overalls as well as my shoe covers. Several farms, many farms have trash cans on site that they can use for just this purpose. Ideally, we would go to the car and take our shoe covers off there, put it, place it in a bag, and throw it away. However, in this case, I'm taking it off here and throwing it away. The reason why we do this is we do not track disease into our car and potentially to another farm. 